Okay, people often ask me, what is one teacher, one scientist? And when I look at the beginning of one teacher, one scientist, I remember the day when I was conducting a workshop, a teacher training workshop in um, South. And um, it was suddenly while doing the workshop that I came up with a feeling, a thought, that it would be great if every teacher in the country gave one scientist. And if each teacher brings in a desire that we, she wants to give, he or she wants to give at least one scientist to our country, I think we would do our job as teachers. It would be such a great service to the nation. And that is when the One Teacher, One Scientist journey began. And today when I sit and create stuff for every teacher, I, I think of ways in which each teacher can actually make children experience science around them. Science, it, it's basically every child is born a scientist. It is just that during the course of growing up, we somehow, a social structure, a social construct, kills that magic and awe in a child. And that is where recreating innovation in a child becomes a task. Otherwise, if we are just able to nurture that awe, that magic, that wonder that a child is born with, I think every child can be an innovator. If we help children connect with the world around them, give them that experiential learning, I think their learning will make more sense. They will connect with uh, what they are studying. And somewhere the disconnect happens while the child gets stuck in the everyday curriculum. The teachers get stuck in, in just making a child go through the syllabus. If we allow children to take charge of their own learning, I think they can all become innovators. And that is the ethos of um, One Teacher, One Scientist, where, where if we help children to connect with the scientist within, with the innovator within, I think we would do our job as scientists, as teachers, and bring about the, the, real, the real innovator that every child has the potential of becoming.